Hi, I'm Rich at Inside HPC, and we're here at the Intel booth at SC11. You know, this this was a big week. Uh, Intel announced uh, the Knight's Corner chip did something really amazing. I'm here with James Reinders. And uh, what they basically announced was that Knight's Corner can do a teraflop on a single chip. James here was, uh, well, why don't you say, you were part of the supercomputing division at Intel in 1997. And you worked on that machine, that the very first machine that did a teraflop, did you not? Absolutely. So I was in the supercomputing division at Intel along with a bunch of people who put together ASCII Red, uh, the world's first teraflop machine. And we deployed that in 97. So. Uh, yesterday, along with other people, I got the opportunity to see Knight's Corner running um, over a teraflop, a uh, D-Gem, double precision, um, on a chip, one chip, and um, it, that was exciting for me. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, what do you think, I mean, that's not that many span of years, but give us, a, I mean, I think people might have forgotten how big was Asking Red, how many, I mean, this thing was humongous, was it not? Oh yeah, it filled a room, it was more than 9,000 Pentium Pro processors when we deployed it and, and exceeded a, a, a teraflop. Uh, you know, we later upgraded it to more, but um, it was, it depends on how you count the cabinets, it was more than 50 cabinets, it was something like 80 counting all the equipment. Um, it filled a room, it was, it was huge, and it was the world's fastest computer for years, uh, and now it's on a chip. <laughs> and I'm still working, you know, I'm not retired or anything. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just the, the, the pace of everything, and it, it you know, uh, I, I think you were telling me the story about this reporter kind of was trying to get a quote from you. It was, it was, it was a little bit of a, a choker, wasn't it? Yeah, it, 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 um, I got asked some interesting questions earlier I hadn't really thought about. I mean, I've known the day is going to come when this is on a chip. Um, you know, intellectual, engineer, I know these things. And mm -hmm. he asked, well, did I feel like, I, you know, I'd wasted time. We could have just waited 14 years. No, I never thought that way. But I thought about how I felt. And it, it was emotional. And that's, uh, even though I know I'm going to see a teraflop on a chip. I know we were close to that. Seeing that and realizing that, you know, I had been part of a team that had to fill a room to do that, you know, not that long ago. Um, and now it's a chip. And we're not stopping there. I mean, we being the industry, I mean, Intel will keep going, but, you know, this industry is fast paced. Well, that's very exciting. Well, I guess congratulations to you and Intel. I think that it's, this is a really fun one here. Well, thank you. We're very excited.